I'm Dang Dakwata, your Infection Prevention and Control Nurse. Today, I'll be giving you the latest IPCC updates in preventing needle stick injury. One of the extra mile innovations of the Pathology and Laboratory Department is the utilization of pre-filled heparinized ABG collection syringe with safety lock features. This syringe is used to extract ABG blood sample using pre-filled syringe or what we commonly known as heparinized syringe. This medical device also offers a simple and effective way to collect blood while reducing the possibility of needle stick injury as one of the perennial problem of healthcare workers safety. I will later demonstrate how to use it, but first, let's identify the contents. Inside this sterile package, we have three items. First, the heparin pre-filled syringe. Second, the needle with safety shield or cover. And lastly, the syringe stopper. And now, let's do the extraction. Start obtaining ABG sample by preparing your materials. Do proper hand hygiene. Then put on disposable gloves. Position the arm and palpate the radial artery. Clean the area with antiseptic skin preparation or alcohol swab. Remove the needle cover. Fully depress the plunger to expel heparin. Then set it slightly above the recommended sample volume of 1.6 ml. Position the syringe needle downward and puncture the skin at 45 degree to 90 degree angle. Allow blood to fill the syringe automatically to the preset volume. Do not push plunger during extraction. Once the syringe is filled, withdraw the needle completely and immediately apply pressure over the puncture site using a sterile gauze or cotton for one minute or more if necessary. Pull backward the needle safety cover against a hard surface until you feel and hear it lock. Detach the needle from the syringe and dispose properly. Seal the syringe with green tip cap or stopper. Label with patient's details and prepare specimen for transport. Remove gloves and perform hand hygiene. Place the blood sample in a well-insulated container with ice packs and transport safely without delays. Please be guided with the process of replenishment of ABG pre syringe. All clinical units will be given a stock-maintaining balance of pre syringe. 10 pieces each for clinical wards and ICUs and 30 pieces for emergency service complex. For every ABG sample submitted by the clinical areas to the laboratory department, using the pre syringe will be replaced with a new syringe at the same time. In cases of failed extraction or defective syringe, these items can be returned or replaced subject to stock availability. Used syringes must be securely capped with a stopper and labeled with defective or failed extraction. Respective clinical units are responsible for dispensing and charging of all used syringes and facilitation of requisition of supply and replenishment from the laboratory department. There you have it. Again, let's utilize this ABG pre-filled syringe efficiently for your safety. Thank you and please be safe.